Good morning, everybody. I am Russ. This is Chris. Who does long reach your ass? Who's going to wash your new Ask the Twin shirt? Uh, we'll shirt. get to this in a minute. Laundry at my house is done by Stephanie on Sundays, unless, unless I am wanting to wear something to work out or bowl in or or if she's gone, but she does laundry laundry on Sundays, and that's And what is day. the reason for that? Because I'll probably screw it up. <laughs> I know if I just walk, because she says, wash whatever you want, just don't wash mine. Yeah. So, But you are a wash everything together. Wash everything together. When you and I lived together in Phoenix, it was, man, just put your stuff in there, I'll wash it. Now I'd wash our stuff together, and then... We'd separate it and yeah. take it, but yeah, you you have the dingiest white shirts. I will throw it. You're yeah. absolutely right. I throw it all in and put the stuff in, go. And the reason I learned that was when I used to go to college, my mom she taught me how to really wash clothes. She went, she knew I. Was. <laughs> Does she know we're talking about clothes washing on this show? Probably, but she she washes clothes. I mean, we wash clothes. We wash clothes on on Sundays, yeah, as well. I, we have two machines. Weekends. We have two machines. We have a washer and a dryer. And Stephanie goes, "This is what I do. Don't mess with it." I'm like, "Hey," and then wash them, puts them in the chair, and we fold them as we're watching TV. She's usually in the bedroom, but she comes in there and takes my chair. We wash. I'm watching bowling. We fold them. Bam, we're done. Once ours beeps, we walk in there, hang them up, move them over, go back and watch TV. Why are y'all both doing it? Because it's faster. You're both in the same laundry room? Yeah. We ain't you. We both fit. Oh, yeah. I, I ain't doing it. You already know. I ain't washing them. Unless I am told, I do not touch them. Yeah. And I've always washed clothes. Well, I didn't have to for, for years, but I wash clothes. And for me, when that buzzer goes off, I have to go hang them. <laughs> because... I, I, they can't be wrinkled. And if I, they sit there, they will get hear, wrinkled. Because sometimes I don't hear. They will get wrinkled. I got to go start them back for five minutes, let them de-wrinkle, and then I hang them. But Did, I have to hang them just like that. We want to know who does it at your house. Dishwasher, hand wash. Hmm? Dishwasher, hand wash. I'm going on a house all oh, day. Oh, 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 oh. Dishwasher, hand wash. Uh, both. It just depends. But it was always hand wash. And now I've kind of been led down the dark side. That's the dark side. And I will throw stuff in the dishwasher now because, because hers is in there and I got to get it full to wash it. So if I keep rinsing them, it, it, they just sit there dirty. So everyone, I'll go, it's just going to fill that up. <laughs> I would rather hand wash than empty a dishwasher. We are on the same page. You went, my woman will not hand wash dishes. <clears throat> she hadn't left for work yet. I know she's in the other room. Will not hand wash dishes. And <coughs> I am the same way as you. I am not emptying that dishwasher. Well. I brought mine to the dark side too, because if it's just a few things, now she washes it out. I don't even. I I, I didn't even lead mine down the path, because I do this. Leave it, I'll do it. Leave it, I'll do. It. But I cook, because she she gets off at six, so I make sure everything's done. But I'm with you. Like when I cook, when I take that pan out and I'm done, I wash that pan right there. I wash that pan dry. I wash the silverware. Get it up. You saw my post with my stuffed bell peppers. You've had them. I've had them. Made them, made them with the turkey and that kind of right. stuff. Well, the other night she come home for one, right? And it was stuffed zucchini. I've had that too. Made the zucchini boat, yeah, with turkey and just a, a spaghetti sauce. I'm telling you, people, sprinkle a little cheese on it. Each deal was like 170 calories, and one of them, two would fill you up. Most people, one of them would fill you up. Yeah. Ah, dang, that much effort. And food. And that's good. It's not like we're, we're going without food. Dude, 
We're not even going to get on this fitness stuff because it's, it's too easy. It wasn't. I was just saying that was a damn good meal that I did not think would be as good. Oh, dude, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo. All right, we're going to keep moving on. <clears throat> Who does the bathrooms? Bless you, Stephanie. And she will not allow me to touch them because I have asked them. She wants them done right. Yeah. So I have asked them, which means I'll wipe all around that stuff that's on there. You know what's crazy? Done. Is you're so OCD, it seems like you would be the guy who has to move everything to clean everything. But you are an OCD in a straight. It can be a mess, but it's got to be in a pile. Yeah, it's got to be a square. It's got to be, you can't have your shit all over the room. Just put yeah. it in the corner. Then it's just in the corner and it's a mess. Yeah, it, it's an organized mess. And it can't be can closed. Have. It can only be like magazine. All in dog toys oh, I in used there. To mess, I used to just mess oh. up the magazines when we lived together. Just to Now, see. I do vacuum. Yeah. I enjoy, and I, it sounds stupid, but I enjoy that. I enjoy vacuum. And when I vacuum, because we have tile floor, I even vacuum my tile floor, I move all the furniture. I push all the chairs. I move the couches because they're easy to move with my foot. I move. I, that is the weird thing. I will move everything, but I ain't going to pick up a toothbrush to wash that counter off. Hey, well, no. I will say this. If y'all no. would have got married the right way, no, y'all might have got one of them steamers we got. I have a steamer. We have a steamer. For the floor? Yeah. And you can't beat that. Those you? are awesome. I mean, it's like mopping without the, the work. You know where I got it? We had it at the... Send them. I mean, at the. At our own office. Yeah. Ah, that's where it went. You're more than welcome to Meredith, buy it. Meredith, Meredith, ours was expensive. And uh, Meredith, Lauren, and Linda Van Cleve went in and, got you and one? pitched in. Well, it got shipped to Meredith's house. And Mert picked it up. And used it. No, it weighed like one pound. It's the lightest thing. And this is the story they tell. Merck goes, three of y'all pitched in? And this, this is all they got? They, they're going to think we're cheap. It's like a $500 deal or something like that. And he's like, we got to get them something else. And she's like, Merck, it's, it's expensive. There's no way it's expensive. Because it, he don't even know what it is. It don't even weigh anything. But... Uh, I am that dude. I am the vacuuming dude. I'm not the steamer though. She does it. She don't. She likes the steamer. I don't know. It's weird. It it really is weird as far as having those those. Cho what are your chores? That's what it is. What are your chores? Do you do them together? Do you have the ones you do alone? Do you not even worry about asking them to do them? Do you just get it done? Because I'm a big just get it done type of dude you know what I mean until she tells me no I just I, I just I, I well I think Stephanie's like Brooks and they've always had to do it so it's not like it's anything for them to do it you know what I mean even taking out the trash Stephanie will take out the trash I, Brooks will too but will. but she don't have to every once in a while to. when we bowled on Thursdays every once in a while I'd come out and you know and she I went hey you don't have to do I got the trash at least no, let me have one man thing. Yeah, do. we don't have those deals. Mine mowed the yards until it was hot. Mine will not mow the yard, ever. Mine mowed the yard till it got hot. She's ever. like, so if it's cool in the morning, she'll mow. And I would not let her mow the yard because she would probably fall and run the lawnmower over her foot. Because if it can cut you, she will get cut by it. Paper, knives, ninjas. Yeah, dang, you need to put her in a bubble. If, I need to put I, Stephanie in a, I need to walk around. She's Stephanie's saying When way. I see her grab a knife, I go, hey, give me that. What are you doing? I, I'm carving an a owl out of this block of wood. I got it for you. Because <laughs> it, it, she would end up bleeding everywhere. Ask the twins. That ain't us. This is Big John and Big George. Whose first business card looked like that? Yeah, that was us. The silhouette. We had the silhouette. They weren't quite that big. Our silhouettes weren't that no, big. No, they weren't that big. 
But they do a show, and you can find it on Big John's page or Big George's page, and they do a show every Sunday, and they do it from the backyard. They go live. Most of the times they're from the backyard. Sometimes they're at home. They I go seen live. them down there last Sunday. <clears throat> and then they do a show. They do enough shows for the week. So, And it's usually bar-related or life questions that they get asked all the time at the bar. It's pretty dang funny. Because you think we get asked some dumb stuff? Wait till you hear some of the deals of like, I saw my man here the other night. Should I went up there and beat him up? I didn't want to kick you out of the bar because I wanted to keep drinking. They get some pretty good stuff. And they've been they've been they've been bouncing and long time security in for a long time. A long that's how time. that's why we met them. Yep. Used them in our first feature. Our first uh, one bad one bad mother. I wish I could find that. Wish I could I find have that. it somewhere. Do you? I think so. Get it, man. I'm gonna put sure. it up. I'm gonna put it pretty up. Pretty sure I do. Watch Big John and Big George. Know, maybe. All right, man, we're going to get out of here. I just burped. Sorry about that. What's this weekend since this is Thursday? We got Kip, Friday. To, uh, Kip Friday. Winger. To, uh, tomorrow, Kip Winger. Who was Winger. <coughs> yes. And will play all his Winger stuff. And he, we had him at Cinema. He is a marvelous musician. And he's just charismatic. He gets people on stage to sing with him. I mean, it, it it's just it's a show. really good time. Headed for a heartache, 17, Dang, look all, at those, you. all those songs, man. Look at I'll be you. there. I'll what be is there. Saturday? Saturday is Zach Wilkerson, another Texas country artist that's, man, kind of kind of bluesy rock kind of bluesy. feel from is what I, what I feel from it. And then don't forget, Sunday, Swimsuit Sunday. Swimsuit Sunday. And we, we may have a promo to put up by Sunday. I, I think we will because we're going. We shot one last night and Tim's yeah. editing it and that kind of stuff. And I don't know why our batteries. It ain't. It's the plugs coming out. Oh, okay. I'll fix it. I'll but fix it. we're going to have pools and water and small pump. pools. Don't yeah. Don't think of diving pools. Almost like uh, the water park deals they have in the parks. Yeah. Out It'll on cool our you down. out on our grassy area just to keep things cool. Change it up a little bit. We'll have live music from one to four. All oh, that good stuff. Mm. It ain't a water park for your kids. Just letting you know. You can bring them. Just beware. Yeah, we don't want them running. I don't them. want them running around slipping and falling. Yeah. Use your head, parents. Let, leave right. that to the adults. Yeah. We're going to get out of here. Have a great weekend, man. And until Monday, I am Russ. This is Chris. We are out of here.